up everybody, it's Titanic Fee Jack and I'm back at you again with another video. Today we're going to take a look at a sneaker, it's an early release, uh, and it's a blast from the past. Oh my god, I really like this sneaker. But before we get into it, I need a couple things from you guys. I need you to hit that like button on today's video. Also, hit that notification bell so you'll be notified every time I come back with another video. I ask that you leave a comment in the comment section. Let me know your thoughts on the sneaker we're about to look at today and your thoughts on the video itself. And sub up to the channel if you haven't already. Now today, this sneaker that I'm going to look at, we said, uh, or I said rather, it's a blast from the past. This sneaker first came to us in 2012 as part of a pack centered around the NBA's All-Star Weekend. And we are coming up on that weekend again, and the sneaker is set to release sometime later in February. I want to say it releases February the 15th. At the time of me recording this video, uh, I mean, let's just get into it, guys, because here's the box. You see all black box, KD logo in the center. Uh, not sure if there's any hype behind this sneaker as I show you all around the box but I know when I learned that this sneaker was going to retro I had to get it because I missed it in 2012 and I had to get it this time and the little birdie ooh, ooh, sent me a message and said come check these out I got them. We're going to look at them. It says KD4 and the color is metallic silver and total orange. This is a size 15 b nards. This is for the tote. The price on these is going to be 130 US dollars, I believe. You have a fold over box top. You see that lot stamp in red right there. You got your tissue paper, smooth on one side, rough on the other. It is nothing else in the box, no extras or nothing. I thought these sneakers would have had a, had something in here, something special. I might have to go back and see what the 2012 pair came in, but let's get into the sneaker. Here we go, guys. We got the first look at the Nike KD4 Galaxy All-Star. This was part of the All-Star pack that re, uh, released in 2012 in Orlando, Florida. You had these. You had the uh, Colbis. And there was another sneaker uh, that came out that was part of this pack. But, uh... Oh, yeah. The Nike LeBron Big Bangs. Yep. All this was part of that pack in 2012. The Big Bang, the LeBron did retro a couple years ago, and now we getting these. I wonder where we get that Kobe from 2012. There's rumored to be the Galaxy phone pilots gonna retro to us as well. So we're gonna see uh, how that works out for us later in 2024, but let's get into this sneaker. This sneaker is made, it's majority metallic silver. It, uh, try to mimic a space suit so keep that in mind kind of like mark and mindy i dream a genie type thing you got that metallic silver all over for the most part you have some uh mesh right here with the total orange underneath you have a, a, a the strap going across the forefoot with the total orange nike suits on the uh on the uh, strap, you have a midsole, and look how good the midsole looks. Look at the midsole, you got that splatter, you, uh, that Milky Way, that Galaxy looking type midsole, and you do have the translucent or Milky translucent hit, and here is the bottom of the sneaker. Back in 2012, these had the glow in the dark, you got that little galaxy piece right there. And I did say these glowed in the dark. Yes, guys, as you can see, look at that glow in the dark. The outsole glows in the dark, just like it did back in 2012. 
and you can see that uh that foot strap that i was telling you guys about it has that 3 m action but the outsole does glow in the dark on the 2024 pair of the nike kd full galaxy oh, and let's look at the heel of the sneaker you have kd's logo and brought it on the heel of the sneaker as we go around to the medial side of the sneaker you have that metallic silver all over and you have that total orange swoosh right here on the medial heel you do have that strap and it says pull for lockdown right here on the strap uh this sneaker is not 3m but the uh strap is yep and i'm gonna unfasten the strap as you can see it says adaptive fit and you got more total orange underneath here that's what the sneaker looks like when you unfasten the strap uh the toe box you see you got that metallic silver small nike swoosh and total orange you have a, a mesh tongue all the way up to here more of that metallic silver and you have your kd patches right here he actually wore number 35 at the time of his career he's back to wearing 35 currently with the phoenix suns as i show you this tissue and we have an insert do the inserts come out yes the insert comes oh actually no it's glued down i'm not gonna mess up my sneaker but uh here's a try to give you guys a good look of the insert you got that galaxy pattern on the inside of the sneaker let's see can i get to that uh before i get to the sizing tag you can see the sock liner it has that galaxy pattern all over oh i just love this sneaker i like this i know guys haven't been wearing basketball sneakers but let's see how many of these guys gonna get these but it says usi 15 and the production did Ooh, this shoe doesn't want to bend it doesn't want to give yeah, I'm back, guys. That production day say June 28th to August the 14th. So you have a couple months of production, almost two months of production with these. So yes, the sizing on these guys, uh, I sized up on these, uh, cause the basketball shoes normally run a little snug. So I got the size 15. If you can go up a half a size, I definitely recommend you can. But if you like your shoes uh, real snug with not a lot of room, you can probably go through the size. But me personally, I sized up in these. So that's what you guys do if you like that fit. These are set to release, like I said, February 15th at the time we record this video. So uh, let me know if you're going to be going for the basketball sneakers, you know. I like my basketball sneakers. Yep, here goes the LeBron Big Bangs and the KD Food. These two of those sneakers that came out in that 2012 All-Star Pack. So let me know your thoughts. If you're trying to complete these Galaxy Packs, let me know that in the comment section. I'm going to go ahead and end the video. Like I always tell you guys, if you can help somebody get a sneaker, help them get that sneaker because you never know where it will be your turn to need help getting a sneaker. I'm Titanic Feet Jack, signing out.